Hello dear friends. <laughs> Good evening. Finally I come to the end of Tuesday evening and I made it to the end. I'm so happy and I'm so proud of myself. And uh, <clears throat> I think it's time for me to stop a little bit. And uh, there will be a conference coming and uh, a professional development, uh, a, a training outside so I can get away from the classroom a little bit. Sometimes I think it's really needed that uh, we have a, li um, a little bit away from the situation we, we are always in to have a change so that we are not too much stuck in. I love my job, there's no doubt about it, but there are times you just need to to <clears throat> nourish yourself and regenerate and rejuvenize yourself. And today it's um, I cannot imagine it. I don't know if I I I, I dare to say it or say it or if I want to say it. In the class, it's a full day class and uh, non-stop, not even a time to to drink water. Every class is is packed. There are sometimes schedules like this, and uh, if you are a teacher, you know it. And uh, <clears throat> I tell students, I was so exhausted at this time, so I tell students, uh, can you do me a favor? You can see that uh, I am not so happy. You know why? Can you guess the reason? And some students said, uh, uh, maybe because the previous class is too cloud, too noisy. Well, this class is also every class is too noisy, or maybe you had a headache, or maybe you are tired, and and that was exactly what I was experiencing. So I I I, I told them, yeah, that was exactly the same thing. So maybe you were saving, you were feeling the same. So how about we change it? Let's make an effort and everyone make a tiny bit effort that to understand other people. And by being quiet, by being understanding, by being conscientious to other people, we are helping other people, you are helping me, you are helping your classmate, and you are helping yourself. And to my surprise, the class it's not a surprise. Every time when I tell students and I ask students to cooperate, it always turns out good. So it was quiet and it was good and it was very productive and everyone enjoyed it. There is no this kind of rowdy and, uh, and uh, uncontrollable situation. It turns out good. I am... I. I, I know that at the, I am at the end of the energy, of the energy of the battery, so need to change, need to recharge. Anyway, let's do an outfit of the day. Today I wear green, I bought it today. And the first thing that make my day start not so well is, let's see, green top, white pants, green shoes, and then I win a came to classroom, the first class, I was preparing the color, boom, a whole bottle of fluorescent pink color drop on my pants. I washed it and all over my shoes and the feet, gosh, that was not the best situation. Well, you deal with it. As an art teacher, you deal with it. So I dealt with it. And uh, I took some time, I found some time to, to clean it up. And so I didn't wear a, <laughs> a very fancy clothing out. And uh, so that actually brings out an, an, an opinion, an idea. Maybe I can put some, from time to time, I can put some paint on top of my shoes and use student level or washable shoes so that I can make it a little bit different and colorful. 
So this is the outfit of the day. What a beautiful green day. To touch the green green grass so To touch the green green grass so I have a green bag from um, from uh, uh, Barnes and Nobles. They always have this this kind of bags and the cargo pants. And there are colors here, here, here. You cannot see. Luckily, you cannot see. To touch the green, green grass of home. So, <clears throat> be happy every day, be silly every day, and uh, sometimes you have to be wise. Sometimes. You know. Bye-bye, friends. <laughs>